Good morning, everybody. It is October 19th, 2023. Uh, it is 525 in the morning. Let's see. 526. My phone says it's 526 in the morning. Okay, so... What I've got for you for this video is, since I had the dream about the number 46, uh, 1 Corinthians uh, in the Revolved Bible, chapter 2. Okay, so in the Revolved Bible, this section is called The Message of Christ's Death. Dear brothers and sisters, when I came to you, I did not come preaching God's secret with fancy words or a show of human wisdom. I decided that while I was with you, I would forget about everything except Jesus Christ and his death on the cross. So when I came to you, I was weak and fearful and trembling. My teaching and preaching were not with words of human wisdom and that persuade people, but with proof of the power that the Spirit gives. This was so that your faith would be in God's power and not in human wisdom. And this section is called God's Wisdom. However, I speak a wisdom to those who are mature. But this wisdom is not from this world or from the rulers of this world who are losing their power. I speak God's secret wisdom, which has kept hidden, which he has kept hidden. Before the world began, God planned this wisdom for our glory. Oh, well that's new. I don't remember reading that before. It doesn't say for God's glory. It says for our glory. What? Okay. Well, hello. Okay. Uh, verse 8. None of the rulers of this world understood it. If they had, they would not have crucified the Lord of glory. But as it is written in the scriptures, no one has ever seen this. No one has ever heard about it. No one has ever imagined what God has prepared for those who love him. Isaiah 64 verse 4. <laughs> but God has shown us these things through the Spirit. The Spirit searches out all things, even the deep secrets of God. Who knows the thoughts that another person has? Only a person's spirit that lives within him knows his thoughts. It is the same with God. No one knows the thoughts of God except the spirit of God. Now we did not receive the spirit of the world, but we receive the spirit that is from God so that we can know all that God has given us. And we speak about these things, not with words taught us by human wisdom, but with words taught us by the Spirit. And so we explain spiritual truths to spiritual people. A person does not have the Spirit, or a person who does not have the Spirit does not accept the truths that come from the Spirit of God. That person thinks they are foolish and cannot understand them. Because they can only be judged to be true by the Spirit. The spiritual person is able to judge all things, but no one can judge him. The scripture says, Who has known the mind of the Lord? Who has been able to teach him? Isaiah 40 verse 13. But we have the mind of Christ. Okay, so we're just going to speak that over ourselves today, this morning, um, for those of you who believe in that. Um, we're just going to speak over ourselves that we have the mind of Christ and whatever God is thinking or whatever God thinks about or 
you know, that we think what he does. And um, there's also that Brandon Heath song, I love it. It says, uh, give me your eyes for just one second. Give me your eyes so I can see. Uh, so, like, we see people the way that God sees them and not the way that humans see them, but the way that God sees them. Uh, because sometimes there's more to people than what we think there is just on the surface. So, okay, so that's all I've got for you for this video. If you like this content, like this video or comment below. I would love to hear your thoughts about this. Um, now don't forget to go out there and rainbow it. Flood the world with love, peace, joy, charity. Thank you and have a good day.